Last weekend, I headed out to eastern Arkansas to do some field work. I had my two friends Caitlin and Matt along for the trip, and our goal was to collect a lot of leaf litter. Things didn't quite go as we had planned. So we're driving along this nice country road, and then suddenly... Three. So we're going to see if we can move this massive thing. Yeah, Otherwise, we might just take an early lunch. So what we have right here is a scare beetle of some sort under the leaves. So this is the grub. And he is quite a large boy. So identification of the grubs is by little hairs on their butts and the pattern that they're in. And turning over rocks, we've uncovered a slimy salamander. Hello. What'd you get? Oh, that's a pyromorpha. Yeah. Is that a lep or a beetle? It's a lep. Okay. It mimics a lysid beetle. Yeah. These are little salamanders. You can see that they're, they're just settled on the rock there. Unmoving. I'm gonna try and get one to swim for us. Very fast. Water break. We found a snake. No bananas. Is it alive? No, I'm not going to touch it. I will. Yep, he's alive. Okay, cool. Does he look like a lumpy loaf of bread? Um, he more looks like he's very wiggled. Hand for scale. Nice. Oh, he licked at me. Aww. He's climbing. Do it, bro. You got it. <laughs> That's awesome. It's like watching a river flow In this tree hole, we clear away the leaf litter and behold. Narcissus Americanus. Also known as the American millipede. It's very patriotic. For some scale. Just beautiful. Just beautiful. And this is the Boston Mountains, part of the Ozarks. And that is a tree that blocked our path. So, we just traipsed through there. Good day, good day.